Hey guys, it's Saturday morning and it's the Vancouver Halloween Parade and Expo today. Sorry, when the seams of my pants aren't on the sides of my legs, it bothers me. <laughs> um, I wanted to be there by now, but I'm not there. And I still have to do my hair and like a quick makeup job. <clears throat> I'll probably be there by 11 and then it opens at 12 so I still have an hour I'll still have an hour to set everything up but I wanted more time than that because it's my first time setting up these metal grates and I've I, want, I don't know how I'm gonna like display my original stuff exactly like one of them's gonna go on this stand one of them can stand up on its own the other two don't have stands so um, yeah I just wanted that extra time to like get ready but uh I was dead when I woke up, like it took me half an hour after I, my alarm went off to actually go shower <clears throat> and so it was rough and then my vlog, I ended up having 51 minutes of footage, I cut it down to like 30 some minutes but I was like I don't have time to sit here and edit 50 minutes of footage, like this will take me well over an hour and so I mean it still took me a long time but some clips I didn't even watch through them. I just trimmed the beginning and end and I was like, well, I hope I didn't like screw up anywhere in the middle because sometimes I'll just stop talking. If I stumble on my words, I'll stop talking and then I'll re-say what I just said. <laughs> and so when I forget to edit those out, it's really embarrassing and awkward. But anyway, moral of the story is we're going to convention stuff sooner, I guess. <coughs> oh, and I have more of a cough today too. My body feels better than yesterday, but I'm coughing, which is kind of gross for like a public event. So, oh, that reminds me, I was going to grab my hand sanitizer because I don't want my germies getting all over everyone. Oh, hello there. <laughs> Sneaking from behind by our baby. Are you stuck? This should be good. I wouldn't mind. I had two at one point. I don't know. Oh, wait, there, there it is. Ha 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 ha. I just looked in there and I was like, where's the other one? Okay, babes toss this in there. I still have to go to Subway and get a sub and then I'm going to come back because initially I was going to take a bus to go there but it takes half an hour plus I have two suitcases like look at these suckers this one's a jumbo one and so I decided I'm going to take a cab instead. Google Maps says a drive is 10 minutes or if you go a different route it's 13 minutes so that'll be faster. They can take me right to the intersection I need to be at and I don't have to struggle with my suitcases on a bus. Although, the ride back might be on a bus, but I'll probably end up leaving one of my suitcases there. Um, yeah, less talking. I gotta quickly straighten my hair, throw on some foundation and mascara, and get out of here. Okay, you guys, I'm here, and here is my table. And uh, I forgot one important thing, it was my paper that I used to make my signs. I had it ready to go in a like in a little portfolio thing, and then I forgot it. So uh, I was gonna make labels for each and every print so people would know what to call it. But I'm not gonna be able to do that to tomorrow. Now I'm gonna take one of these, flip it backwards, and make a label for the buttons here. And then I don't know what I'm gonna do for a bigger sign to say that prints. Uh, I don't know. Let's tape, tape some of these together. I'm not sure. Hey, Bales, why did you do that? <clears throat> also, my stand is shorter than I originally intended. It was going to be four squares high, and I realized that's just too tall. I guess I could build it on the ground and raise it onto the table. I might try that next time, but um, I feel like it might get too unstable, because what I ended up doing, instead of doing a fourth tier, I put some grates at the bottom, just like a little corner reinforcement, and um, also some here. And actually just right there, that table, is people I went to, to school with at the Art Institute. And um, there's two of them, and then there was a third person, Ryan, he was helping out and stuff, and he helped me build <laughs> my little cage thingy, so I was very grateful for that, because these are super, super hard to snap together. I don't know if it's just the ones I got, but it was a nightmare trying to get them all put together. So I was very <laughs> grateful that I had his help. So, yeah, oh, I also need to, yeah, I'll probably also make signs, use my business cards to make signs on all these guys. Oh jeez. I'll give you guys like an overview of the room. I've never been here before, I don't know what to expect. 
I feel like it'll draw in a lot of people other than the typical anime convention goers, even though this feels a lot like an anime convention artist alley. Okay, here are my signs. One sign there, a little sign here made out of two business cards, and one here. It's kind of nice though, because it reduces clutter. I do wish I had names. People can just point to the one they want, but I think tomorrow I'm gonna bring the paper to make the labels for the prints. What's really nice is they have Wi-Fi here, so I can actually connect directly with my iPhone because it has the app that I need to take credit card payments because this doesn't work on Android in Canada. There's no app for it, but in the US there is. It's so stupid. So I'm probably actually going to switch over to Square. If by the time my next convention rolls around they haven't made an Android app, then I am going to have to buy Square because, yeah. Like, I can tether to this phone, but I have to like enable the mobile hotspot. It takes time, it's annoying. So far it's been pretty slow, although it's been like an hour. <laughs> but um, yeah, right now I'm pressing buttons. I tried removing this grate to see if I could press buttons, but it shakes the table too much, like it shakes the whole display. So I'm doing it right here. I have to like straddle the chair and I still feel like it's too far away. It's gonna kill my back. Uh, I've done three buttons so far. So yeah, hopefully things pick up later. I'm really bad for like thinking to vlog when people come to my table, like who know who I am, because I mean, some people don't want to be shown, but I can ask like, oh, do you want to be in the vlog? And oh, I always like forget, and then I feel stupid. Anyway, so um, Nicola just came by my table and she gave me this awesome knitted scarf. Oh, oh, okay, let me make sure I'm showing the proper side. If I can remember what the proper side is. Oh yeah, I see, I see. I know some things I can tell. <laughs> Look at this. Ah, that is so gorgeous and it's an amazing color. My turquoisey that I love. So yay, I'm so happy and it's just really nice. Like I don't know, when people put time into making something, just feel like golf. <laughs> I don't know. And um, she also bought the original butterfly collage. So that one's gone, so I rearranged a little bit. Since this one's in a really big frame, I moved that one over to that corner to fill in the space. And then the other two are still chilling right here. I haven't sold any prints yet, but I've sold some buttons. Wait, did I sell a button pack? I don't remember. Maybe. No. No. I think I've just sold individual buttons and then the original um, butterfly collage. So, yeah. One thing I was thinking of doing, but I didn't end up doing it because I wasn't oh, sure how much table space I I'd have and I kind of ran out of time, is I thought it'd be cool to bring my Surface Pro and prop it up on the table and have videos of my playing and then set it near my like little card holder and that way it would grab people's attention and they'd see someone drawing something and they'd be like, oh, what is this? That kind of thing. And so I didn't know there'd be Wi-Fi until like a few days ago because I could, I was thinking of making a custom playlist and then playing that playlist on YouTube, but then I thought what I could also do is just throw together a bunch of videos back to back in Premiere and export it and do it like that, but it never happened, but maybe next time. Someone was talking to me about how she hasn't seen much Cora stuff here, and she was looking at my Cora buttons, and I just realized now that I did not put up my Cora print on display. I don't know why, I think it's because, oh yeah, it's because I had all my old display prints together. I'm gonna have to display a nice one, because I had like a scuffed up one that I was gonna use for my display and I must have forgotten to put it with the other display prints because I don't have it, so I'm gonna hang up a good one. Even though I really like my setup, the sucky thing is from certain angles you can see right through the prints and you can see the metal grate. Like, uh, like if you're if you're looking at it from the right angle or it's not being directly backlit, like look, that looks great. That's fine. And then ride shoes, like kind of see through, and this one's like mega see through. So I might have to change it up in the future where I have some kind of backing on them, but not something that sticks out of the edge like I did with my foam board, but like I don't know, some chipboard or uh, something. Maybe. All right, every. Oh. I have no voice when I start talking. My voice comes out, and there's like this pain. It happens once, and then I'm fine. Okay. Um, just kind of put stuff away. Some stuff is staying here in that suitcase. The rest is coming home with me, and that is it. Right now it's 8:25. Technically, I can stay till 9, but there's like no one left. I'm like one of the last artists here. I would have left sooner, but I just wanted to press more buttons and stuff. And I got through as many buttons as I could, like I ran out of button parts, and so did pretty 
well. And now I'm good and I can leave my button maker at home tomorrow. And um, yeah, these last couple hours were brutal. Probably since like seven. I haven't made a sale since like before seven o'clock. Which is an hour and a half. No, it's been it's been at least two hours since I made a sale. It was it just got dead at like 5.30, it was like everyone was gone and I think it's because like this place is on fairgrounds like there's a an amusement park right next to us and in October they do Fright Nights which is like a Halloween theme I don't know, like do everything on Halloween theme and they have haunted houses and stuff so everyone's probably there <laughs> so um packing up early and heading home and I'm probably not gonna stay up late tonight. I'm gonna try to get as much sleep as I can. I'm home. Oh, pee pee. I don't wanna show my hairy legs. First thing I did was I took my pants off. No, bear, bear. No, no, I can't even. I don't wanna talk. My throat is being weird. Hi, huh, Kiki. Little baby. Hey. Midnight, no. No. My back, like in the middle of my back really hurts. I think it's a combination of like hunching over to press buttons. Which just kills me nowadays. Even like sitting on the ground, sitting in the chairs, it's kind of the same thing. It just kills my back. And also anytime I coughed, it would like really hurt my back muscles. In my diaphragm, obviously, it's very sore. But I took two of those Tylenols like earlier in the day, and I took two more about like two hours ago. But it's not helping me in the same way as it did the other night because the other night was more like achy body, sinus pain, that kind of stuff. Now it's like I mean, I still feel tired and stuff, but I don't have like the sinus pain or anything like that. It's just like kind of like the sore throat, coughing kind of thing. Can you stop scratching my suitcase, baby? I don't have the energy to scold you. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't think I'm going to relax for the rest of the night. Oh, it's just a little after nine. It's so early. <laughs> so, um... Come here, baby. Turn, turn. You bad baby. You bad baby. Um, I might also edit this vlog tonight so that I don't have to do it in the morning. Although, actually, it won't be that bad to do it in the morning because... Like, I don't need to be there early to set up or anything tomorrow. I mean, I have to put a few things out on the table, but that's basically it. Like, if I get there at 11.30, that's more than enough time, which would mean leaving at 11, so. Eh, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll start editing it tonight. I guess it doesn't really make a difference, because I could just go to, if I don't do it tonight, I'll just go to bed earlier, and if I want to do it tonight then I would wake up later. I don't know. I can't brain. I can't brain. I cannot brain today. I has the dumb. I shouldn't let you chew that. But I just, I can't. I don't have the energy for your shenanigans. Oops. <laughs> your shenanigans, baby. Not a baby, talk in my hand. Babes, I missed you. I missed you lots today. Yeah, I did. Okay, maybe I should put my purse away. If it was maybe one of my other purses, I wouldn't care for it. This is my coach purse. Hi. Baby. It turns out I did forget my sub. I was wondering, because... I ordered that sub this morning and I only ate half of it. I thought for sure I'd eat all of it because usually I just like eat out of boredom at conventions, but I guess I didn't have as much of an appetite. And I had it sitting right next to my purse when I packed everything up. And I must have just forgotten to grab it. Dang it. I don't think it's in my purse. I don't think there's room in there <laughs> with my camera case and everything. It could be in here. It could happen. No, it's not in there. Dang it. Well, that was a waste of half a sub. I mean, I'm not actually even hungry right now. I maybe just eat like one of these granola bars or something. 
It's time for the SpongeBob joke of the day. Why did Patrick hold a stone and a Krabby Patty bun to his ears? He wanted to hear some rock and roll. Oh my. Why? Why? There's these really cool like horror movie posters in the middle. They're kind of silly. It's like, I don't know, I like it. So I calculated out my float and it, it seems like lower than I thought it was gonna be based on how the day went. I even factored in the credit card transactions I took. But I didn't go, wasn't going in with big expectations anyway. And just based on the fact that like it started out dead, it kind of picked up and then it was dead again. And just how there wasn't much traffic compared to other conventions, like I guess that's to be expected from something like this. Like it's just a different kind of convention. And I don't think many people know about it. Like I was talking with some other artists and we're like, we didn't even know about this convention. Like they don't seem to advertise it, but I don't know. I don't know, it's alright though. I knew it wouldn't be anything big, so yeah. And there's still tomorrow, I guess, but Saturday is always the biggest day, so I'm like, oh, tomorrow's gonna be even worse than this, and then it's not very good. I just show you guys some uh, artwork I got from Maria, aka Mars. Dun, 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 dun. Such a cute little package. Ow, ow! Holy mama, you need to take a lesson from Kiki and not use her claws so much. No. No. So I've got a little bookmark. This fairy drawing. And this has a little letter on the back of it. And then this beautiful drawing right here. So if you're watching this, thank you again so much. Oh, and this pencil. So that was so nice of her. So many things, so many things, and they're not for you, they're for me. Are you trying to wear my pants? Is that what you want? Oh, she's going deeper as I pull the leg out. Here we go. Go, Kiki, go, run free. <laughs> run through the tube of death. I mean, the tube of fun. I think you're supposed to wear the pants on this end, not on this end. That tickles. Attacked. Kiki's SS pants is under attack. Ship's going down. <laughs> She's not going down without a fight. <coughs> oh, capsized. <laughs> I want to like full laugh, but I know it's going to hurt so bad. <laughs> Kiki, are you stuck? Oh, you're hungry. Okay, good. Yeah, I see you, Kiki. Anyway, I don't think I'm gonna be out much longer, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you tomorrow for day two of the Vancouver Halloween Parade and Expo. Ooh, that is cute. Okay, the button packs are done. Oh yes. 
Um, the blue and the pink look the best, I think. If I had some kind of teal, that would be the best. <laughs> teal and like a lighter pink, like a slightly more baby pink, that would be nice. 